Okay, hello and welcome back. This is Instaturist and I'm continuing playing Brothers in Arms Hell's Highway. Yeah, last episode we jumped from the burning building. All right, this scene. So here we are, in the middle of the enemies, and only armed with the pistol. And the rabbit hole goes deep. I'll probably go on the left. What is? Oh, there's ammo cache. Okay, so that should be my first area to go and see if there's something I could use. Probably. Most of your weapons were lost in the river. Do you do your best to conserve ammunition? Uh, yes. And we are still trying to find Frankie. So I can probably go here. Also, I'm interested to go here. Okay. Eliminate German patrols. So I just can't uh, go around them. I have to eliminate them also. Well, to be honest, uh, yeah, that's usually what happens when I play stealth games. Uh, am I in danger to be spotted? I don't think I am. I'll just go and see. Yeah, I noticed I have for... Uh, well, haven't spotted those... Um, Recon points. Uh, I always forget them while I'm playing, so I really don't even try to find them. Obviously, the windmills are easy to spot, but there are other spots. Uh, uh, the Kilroy's really doesn't do anything. I don't know if they ever did. Basically, they're just uh, little Easter eggs. Uh, and uh, no more info, no additional information. Uh, but uh, recon points actually give you those recon information. Um, so I've been tempted to see that if after the main game the, I'll collect the points where I haven't been, uh, pump it on cash, or go every chapter and just get those recon points, but I uh, have to see, have to see. Also, I don't really know how far, how long this game still goes. I know I play quite slowly, but uh, still, I can get ammo from here. Hopefully I can get a gun also. Oh, now I wish I had melee, but unfortunately that is something that is not in this game. Oh. Can I get your rifle, please? Did you not... ...drop? No, you didn't. That's a little bit cheating. He had a rifle, and I'm almost certain that these guys will shoot me also. I think they want me to... Okay, that's not good, that's not good. Need to reload. I'll try to see if I can hit this one. First. I think I did. No, he managed to hit me though. Well, it's, it's realistic. Um, pistol is accurate around 25 meters. I don't know what's that in... 
and that's in optimal conditions. Uh, hmm. So they can see me through there. I could see if I could go a little bit farther around. Run, 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 run. Fortunately, now I remember I can run. Unfortunately, you can't steer while you're running. So... You win some, you lose some. That is too far away, but I'll take the shot. If I... Get lucky. Ah, uh, no, I don't. Hopefully I don't uh, meet more enemies while I'm running like a headless chicken. Those sounds like angry hornets. No, 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 no. I really should take a target and stick with it. Okay, I need to definitely get closer. Oh no 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 no! Oh no no! Okay, I think I have to be more aggressive. So I go on the right and go much closer than I was earlier before they activate. Okay. Yeah, I wish I could actually turn. But this is as fast as you can turn, but at least we can run. So I have to remember that will be behind me, but I want to go as close as I can towards these guys so I can kill them. Well, there are some sandbags over there. That would give cover from behind. What happens if I go... Come on. Now I can vault. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Let's try that again, but uh, in a more secure position. I had hoped that I could kill the second one, but unfortunately I apparently missed, so that... If I had killed him, that would have gone a little bit better, there. but... No point in crying the spilt milk, let's just do that again, but now with more accuracy. Maybe in a little bit cover. Let's grab the ammo first. Then just run. I could actually kill you right now. Okay. No. Yeah, the guy behind my back is problematic. Hmm, the pistol is not that accurate, which is obviously realistic. No complaints about that. So, yeah, you are there, okay. There's the patrol that comes right over there, and two guys over here, or are they the same? If they are the same, I could wait... No, they're definitely different. So the problem is, I really need to... Hmm. Come on. Come on. Okay. Let's see where those guys go. Um, 
They are going that way. Can I take cover behind this car? Yes, I can. Now I'll... Yeah, this is the problem. I couldn't even hit them at the moment. Okay, one down. Hopefully I can get the gun. No, 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 no. Okay, there's a guy over there. That's not good. Reload, reload. Come on. Okay. Can I get... Oh. Yeah, that almost cost my life. Oh! Okay, let's do that again. Uh, that works, but the problem is I couldn't see anything because of red screen. Red, red screen. Um, so apparently I wasn't in cover. I was... <laughs> I was uh, wrong side of the cover. That worked almost. Almost. Although, if I kill these guys, could I get a gun? If I can get a gun, that would be nice. Can I use this as a cover? I can. Okay, he dropped the gun. Ah, oh. okay. I'll try to see if I can still take the guy uh, over here and if he still drops a gun. Um, oh wait, something come up? Okay. Oh, where is it? Okay, so I'll take the guy, guys that are outside and hope if I, I'll try to take the guys from the outside and hope if I, if they would be so gracious to drop a gun, that would make my life much easier. Well, not easier, but at least a little bit easier because the pistol really can't fire far. Although the MP40 is not that accurate either but it's better than nothing at all the problem is that guy is easy to kill oh. well easy and easy come on i would like to wait i can't remember does he come back Okay, those guys are over there. So I definitely take a shot now and hopefully get the gun. He at least dropped the MP40. And now I have it. Can I get ammo for it? Actually, I can. And now I have to get back to cover. Okay. A little bit better. I probably missed the f weapon on the first time. This is not accurate weapon at any rate, but... I'm not certain if I hit him or not, but if I can, I could move co closer now. At least this has a suppression. Okay, back to cover. Uh, those guys behind are the problematic parts at the moment. Okay, one down. Okay, so far so good. So, did I get the guy behind that? I 
think I did apparently. But there has... There's one, yes. Behind the truck, I mean. I saw the legs. So, I'm guessing I did manage to kill the guy behind there. Okay. That, that, that was weird. Okay. A little bit better. Keep failing enough of times, uh, you probably make something. Or not. <laughs> Anyways, we managed to push on. Yeah, the, the idea was similar what to do with the pistol, but unfortunately the pistol didn't have the range to do it. The question is... There we need to go, but I'll try to see if I can see anything and probably why they were burning beds. Especially if we're worried about air airstrikes. Okay. There's definitely probably how many actually Two recon points and three killroys. Probably a killroy somewhere over there, maybe or there. Anyways, I think we need to move on. Yeah, I have to check that, but I probably missed the gun he dropped on the first time. Was that actually? Yeah, that was. Okay, so Frankie's stuff is also here. So it's for Frankie. Uh, okay. This seems like a place where we might get some. Visions. Uh, maybe. I might be wrong, but we will see. More ammo. So basically, yeah, I had reloaded that gun and we are okay. Occipital. Frontal. Okay, we got heart. So it's definitely a hospital. Can I? No, I don't think I can. So the hospital is burning also. Hmm. There were a little physics with that chair. Oh, I can vault over this. There's two ways to move on. Damn, that bloom is... I, I just thought that there was something over here, but apparently it's not. It's uh, similar like in the last episode, there were the plates. They were so bright, so those, those seemed like something of an interest, but no, they were just plates. Okay. 
uh, antiseptic alcohol probably and something else and bones this feels more like a horror movie or horror game than a world war game at the moment oh there's something we can find what is that Oh, it's a chair. It looked like a head. Okay. And they're there. Oh. Hopefully I didn't miss anything over here. But stop moving. Okay, that's not good. That's good. Okay. Just checking my recording is doing okay. Yes, yes it is. I'm a little worried there a little for a while. No, it's still a chair. And some flies. Anything right? Did you have any other guns than MPs? No. Oh, rocking horse. You scared me there. No, startled more likely, but. Uh... Now I'm worried that I will miss something happening if something is going to happen. I want to see if there's any... Yep. Stop moving. I think it's the bombing. Right. Okay. That's perfectly normal. Right. Hot water. Should I be worried of left or right? Apparently right. Uh, left, I mean, not right. Right seems to be... Dead end. At least it was dead end for those guys. <laughs> I'm hilarious. Um, anything? Skulls? I'm well, definitely missing things, probably, most likely. Absolutely. No, I have full ammo, so that really doesn't matter. Okay, 
Okay, I'm hearing something. What is this? Oh, it's a st stove. Interesting. Is that a radio? It sounds like a radio. <clears throat> yeah, okay. Um, apparently I didn't hit the guy on the back. I was a little bit worried that I don't have the gun anymore, but apparently they didn't take it away. Good. Okay. I'll go get the ammo and we can continue straight away here. Okay, this is a little problematic. I don't think I can shoot through the Well, again, I was going to say it's problematic, but it really wasn't. <laughs> so yes, there's definitely... I need to go over there, I think. Before we go, I'll check the rest of this area. Now that's a huge chair. I can't go over there, so yeah. That thingy is on my right. Is it a lamp? Yeah, I think it's the lamp that is giving that noise. Fortunately, it doesn't uh, blink. That'd be annoying. Oh! <laughs> no, 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 no. That was awkward because I was stuck in the car. I guessed that there would be enemies over there, but uh, I didn't realize it would be so close. And yeah, there's. And I was stuck in the cover mechanics. It's not as uh, maneuverable as in, let's say, like in Gears of War. You get stuck there and uh, stuck there, and uh, it takes a little while to leave. Um, I'm guessing that's the way we need to go. Maybe, or maybe not. Uh, ah, I want to make sure. This looks like a dead end, definitely. And, yeah. Oh, sure, now I found these. Now I found these. Find these. So I'm... This is washroom, I think, and let's go through here. Can he see me? I'm not certain. But I'm feeling I'm not be able to shoot through this. Two ways to... Well, we can't go through here, so we need to go down here. I'll have to, how much do I have coffee left? Mm. Just a little bit. I need to get some fresh, more fresh coffee soon. Okay. Uh 
Oh, there you are. Oh! I tried to go on the cover, but uh, on the... Next to the door frame and try to see there, but uh, that didn't really work out as planned. Where am I? I thought I got a checkpoint there. Uh, I thought I got a checkpoint there. Apparently, I didn't. Well, that's a bummer. Fortunately, we don't have to take time with this. Come on. Did we take... Oh, we did take the ammo. Okay. That is fine. How about the other Germans over here? Oh, they come from there. Okay. Uh, I have no idea if it uh, counts that I took it. It does. Okay. That was a little bit weird. I couldn't move forward. Yeah. That is something it's uh, saved. There came the loading screen, so I thought that it would be a, also a checkpoint, but apparently it isn't. Can I shoot you through here? I Apparently I can. So why not to do that? Making my life a little bit easier. Anymore? No. Yeah, I was definitely certain that this would be a checkpoint, but it was only a loading. Okay. No, no, no. Come on. That works. Anything... Well, at least more ammo. Oh, no, no, I'm stuck. I was stuck in the door frame. Um, so it was behind me. Uh, yep, that one killed me. Okay, that, those, that explains quite a lot. That explains quite a lot. Um... I didn't even realize this perceptive... I'm so perceptive at this game at the moment. Oh! That is the first time I found all the Kilroys in the map. Okay. I had hoped a little bit more of those uh, visions. Hopefully I haven't missed anything. Okay. So, no idea what I was checking there because... Oh, there's a radio. Can I do something about it? I think I should. Oh! Recon area. Okay, these are the recon areas. Okay, I managed... Oh, I haven't read the recon report. Okay, let's do that now. Um, 
Yeah, the radios apparently are recons also. Okay, good to know. Recon report. Um, although the German invasion of Holland was swift and brutal, the Germans viewed the Dutch as fellow Aryans, and thus the initial occupation was less repressive than in other conquered nations. At first, many Dutch accepted the occupation. However, as the German occupation became more oppressive, forcing men to work in German factories, withholding rations, and executing civilians, the support for Dutch resistance movements increased dramatically. Even though the punishment for involvement, even suspected involvement in any resistance efforts, was death sentence, many brave Dutch civilians saw the need to fight against their German oppressors. Although the resistance movements engaged in similar activities, sabotaging phone and railway networks, forging ration cards, running underground newspapers, hiding Jewish citizens and enemies of the regime, the, and even attacking German officers at the resistance took the form of small, decentralized, completely independent organizations. By the time the Allies invaded in 1944, intelligence identified four major resistance organizations. The Knoppleurg, okay, I'm probably mispronouncing this, or Assault Group, the Radvan Verdet, or Council of Resistance on Order Dien, Dien, Order Dienst, or Orders of Service, and the Landelige Organiste vor Hulp. Uh, okay, that's definitely wrong. Or National Organization for the Help of People Hiding. Uh, although the German invasion of Holland was swift and brutal, the Germans. Oh, yeah, okay. Uh, oh, it was only two papers, uh, two break pages. So we have 501st uh, CEO Colonel Howard Johnson. Colonel. Colonel. Howard Johnson works with the Dutch resistance members to plan out attack German positions. Men of the 506th uh, Trooper Infantry Regiment, I think, maybe, uh, with members of Dutch resistance while well working in Eindhoven. And, yes. So this is the new. The firebomb left the roads littered with deep debris that would need to be cleared before the Zodiac call could be moved up. For the 101st Airborne, the first day of the invasion brought almost equal parts of success and failure. The airdrops were largely, unsuccess largely successful, landing the majority of the division's manpower and material on target. The 501st successfully dropping at the DZA managed to quickly defeat the light resistance in the town of Wegel. Segia bought the bridges and set up a strong roadblock near the town of Erde. The 502nd dropping in the DZ DZB right outside of the St. Odenrode had equal success in capturing the town and its uh, bridge over the Dommel River. Uh, later in the day, the corridor near Son once again came under attack by the 107th Panzer Brigade. Uh, the 107th focused on, focused on selling the trucks along the corridor and shutting down 30th Corps advance. The 506th with armored support from 30th Corps tank Core tanks, uh, re tank re regiments launched a counterattack against the encroaching armor. Although the counterattack managed to stall the enemy tanks and protect the road, the combined mi might of the American and British forces was not enough to force a retreat. I'll check the uh, pictures soon. Uh, further north of the combined forces, uh, 30th Corps le lead tanks and the 82nd Airborne 500. Both uh, paratrooper infantry regiments were able to take the bridge in Nijmegen intact. This event marked the largest success in the 82nd mission. The enormous steel bridge in Nijmegen was the 82nd uh, airborne primary mission. The bridge stood over the only suitable path into Arnhem, and if destroyed, it was too large for 30th Corps engineers to reconstruct. If the 82nd failed to capture the bridge, it would have been meant uh, an instant end to Operation Market Garden. Conversely, the bridge safety provided a glimpse of hope towards the operation's success. Yes. So, the firebombing, yes, uh, clear for 30th Corps. The open terrain around the highway made that it's difficult to predict or defend against. And the large bridge in Nimegen was the single most important objective towards the success of the entire operation. Yes. Um, I'll go get grab some coffee and I'll be right back. And time to continue. Continue. Oh, there was the hole. Okay.
I really can't see anything from... No, there's... No... I... Yeah, I can't. Oh, well. Okay. Well... Operating theater. Frankie! Son, don't do this. You know, I didn't think it'd be like this. I feel... I felt like if I just saved one person, it was good I came. I, uh, found her. We got stuck in here, so I sent her off before the crowds could get at us. Frank! Slow down. I gotta tell you something. Don't. Don't be my dad right now. Go back. Just go back and let me save her. Please. Not... Not good at all. And we got a save point. Okay. Alright, oh, I don't have to check for the... Kill... Did I get... Kill Royce at all, but... Um, either uh, we will find another recon point or I probably missed it. Okay. Let's move on. Obviously, I'm always watching on the wrong way. So, there it is. Can I? No. Okay. I'm guessing we need to move forward. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, left. Anyone inside? No. Nobody's coming behind. Well, this is eerie. Oh, right. Okay. So are there chairmans over there? Most likely there will be. Because this definitely looks like a place where there will be chairmans around. Or is it? Am I completely wrong? No, I can't even go there. Okay. Hopefully I didn't miss anything. Okay. That's just a pile of paper. Right. No, I can't see anything. Uh, come on. Now we can move. Can I go? No, I can't because there's a, quite a drop behind it. Well, so we have cozy chair in a bathroom. Right. Well, to be honest, that's. Stuff moving about. Hmm. 
can't interact with the switch. Nothing over here or there. Maybe. Hopefully. So I guess we need to go over here. Yeah, don't kick around the wheelchair. No luck at standing in the doorway. Nope. I have to say, Frank is quite fast. Well, most likely he doesn't even care about his... Uh, well-being, so that might be one reason. Damn. <laughs> sorry, Sarge. Oh, don't be sorry. You did good. Did she? <clears throat> did she get out okay? Yeah. Yeah, she's fine. <laughs> Liar. He's gone. Matt, he's gone. We have to go. Look at me. Let's move, Matt. Follow me. Okay. So we are con rendezvous with the squad for future obje objectives. Okay. Ah. <sighs> Just go under it. We gotta move. Damn, Matt. What guns do I have now? Okay. I have mine. Shit! Watch out! Oh no. Get down! Oh right, uh, this is our tutorial area. Shoot him, Matt! Shoot him now! Keep up the fire! Yep. I'm going. Okay, yeah, this is our tutorial area. Um. Oh right, I have to go up over this. Where are we going now? Over here, obviously. No, 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 no. They're pinned down! I think we got them all! Yeah, we got it. Almost. Got myself killed there. Yeah, there's one on the left side. Hopefully I'm in cover at the moment. Yeah, still over there. I don't think I can hit him from here, so I need to go over. They got reinforcements! Can I? Yes, I can. No, 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 no. In cover. 
Yeah, those guys. Those guys are problematic. Um, yeah. Come on. At least one down. Come on, reload. Come on, pop your head, pop your head. Yep. I think I need to move. At least here. One step closer to going home. Hopefully. Oh, you're dead. Okay. Come on. Cover. Pressure's on him. I think that was the last of them. Hopefully. Hopefully that was the last one of them. Um, okay. It would be a shame to die at this point. Hmm. Okay. There goes the light. There goes the lights. <laughs> the whole city. God, Matt, all those people. Definitely. Point. Uh, can't see anything, but there are Germans around here. Hopefully, I managed. I can't get a shot. I killed one more. They won't have that good position for much longer. Uh, no, I guess they don't. So, come on. Come on. And this was the part where they told us that we can shoot through the cover. Okay. Do I need to be... There's no one there, Matt. He didn't know. Thought he was doing the right thing. We would be better men to respect that. Yeah, but I still died. Yeah. He did. Okay. they got him he was always so damn spry he took a bunch of them with him was it quick at least not especially sorry I, I didn't I didn't mean to uh... sorry Jeep feels emptier you know stop the Jeep what? Stop the goddamn jeep! Now what? Looks like Dawson had to piss. On a... British guy? Where did you nick it from? What? Mate, I really suggest you don't do that again. Where? Eindhoven! I 
didn't think anyone would want it back. You were wrong. Mike, what the hell are you doing? You know, for a few minutes, I actually believed in your shit, Baker. What the hell is wrong with you? It's just a random Brit in an American jacket. Would you calm down? Does this look random to you? Why did you let Jasper write that on the hood? It was funny at the time. What about now? Has its <clears throat> moments. The shifter gets stuck one more time and I'm gonna put the bitch out of her misery. We're leaving. Are you turning your back to me? In case you forgot, Nancy Drew, we're not solving a fucking mystery here. We need to get to Odin Road. So Mosh and that new kid were the only casualties? Yeah, so far. Can I speak freely? <laughs> Son, in case you ain't noticed, this ain't exactly headquarters. No need to be so polite. Speak away. It's Baker. Something's not right with him. What do you mean? Don't tell him I told you any of this. But he was seeing stuff that wasn't there. He takes it all so hard, you know? When men die. And how do you take it? Nothing good was ever free. Move, Friar! I'm just gonna drop a couple through the block and be on my merry little way. Paddock, you are not shooting the jeep! I think everyone needs to get some rest. <laughs> yeah, I guess you're right. Wait, what should we do about Baker? Well, I guess you're gonna have to talk to him, Red. You never told me anything, remember? Well, this sounds up How's your hand? <laughs> now that's funny coming from you. Ow! What the hell was that for? Doesn't feel like very long ago, does it? I don't really notice it much, to be honest. Seems a mite selfish to get all worked up over losing a finger. Where'd you put your wedding band? I keep it around my neck. Ermit sent me back here on my hands and knees if I lost the damn thing. I want five minutes with General Taylor to voice how little I like driving in columns like this. Zeno! <laughs> what? Might as well be on parade, we're so easy to pick off. We're stuck in traffic. In a war. I'm just saying! Five minutes and we don't get stalled out every time something gets broken. Rendezvous is at checkpoint 18. I think it's a cafe. Meet me there. Don't be late. Okay, current Secure Vega. What guns we do have? M1 4 and trusty old pistol. Just taking a little. Okay, come on. Let's go in the cover so I don't die instantaneously. So, secure town plaza, and then we don't know what we need to do. This is going to be interesting. There's some artillery over there, which we definitely need to take down. Ammo cache, or weapon cache. Oh, right. Yeah. Yes, you can see those recon bites, I think, at least three of them. Okay. Anyways, uh, this is going to be a little bonus or late episode, uh, which I'll start to upload as soon as I end this recording. And uh, this is going to be up as soon as it's done. So this is going to be uh, before Sunday, Monday night. Anyways, well, basically this is going to be Thursday for me. Anyways, um, I hope you enjoyed this episode and I will see you next time. Until then, goodbye.